Welcome back, Coach Letha here. Today we are going to utilize our space. You know how we all need our space? Let's revamp that. We are going to take all of the space available so that we can get a great workout in. Today is all about moving in motion, taking regular stagnant moves and bringing it forward. All right, let's go. Just a side note, for this entire workout, if you have bad knees, I tread on light waters here. This is going to be high impact exercise, so you will be jumping and landing pretty harshly on your feet. All right, if you're good to go, let's go. For our warm up, we're gonna go ahead and start at the back of the room, and we're gonna go ahead and jog back and forth. Okay, let's go. One more. Great job. Now we're gonna start at the back of the room and we're gonna perform jump squats in motion. Okay, let's go ahead and set a goal for six lines. That's potentially three rounds. Okay, ready? Great job, everyone. Okay, let's move on to the next exercise. Okay, so the next exercise is going to be a lunge just here in place. This is what a lunge looks like. But now you're going to push forward and do a walking lunge just like that. Let's go six lines, that's three rounds. Ready? And let's go.
Okay, are you feeling it yet? Now we're gonna get into the dreaded burpee. But don't worry, it's gonna be fun when you put it in motion. Okay, you ready? Let's get started. Let's do one more round. Let's go. Great job, you guys, we did it. That was the toughest one. Let's go on to the next one. Okay, for our next exercise, we're doing something called the grapevine, or also known as the karaoke. You are moving your feet behind and twisting your hips at the same time. Okay, are you ready? Great job, you guys. That one looks easy at first, but it definitely gets tougher. If you need to do more than six lines for that one, go for it. Let's keep moving. You think I'm letting you skate through this workout? Well, today I am. Today we're gonna do skaters. You're gonna lift one leg up onto the other, putting your balance and weight on one side, and then we're gonna take it in motion. Are you ready? Ready? Thank you. 
And for our sixth and last exercise, we're gonna go ahead and do an inner jump outer squat. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Last line. You did so good. Let's go ahead and go down for a stretch. Okay, so for this stretch, you're gonna have one knee pointed out this way and the other leg straight out. And let's go ahead and bring it around just like this. Let's not bring our chest towards our knee. Today, we're gonna just bring our hands right over our head and hold that stretch. And after three breaths, we're gonna go ahead and go on to the other side. Excellent job. Now for our next stretch, we're gonna take the soles of our feet and put them together and go ahead and lean forward. Do not hunch or bend your back. Try and keep a neutral spine. Excellent job. Now we're gonna go ahead and bring our feet behind us just like this. And on your palms, you're going to press up just like that. And you're gonna take it down to your forearms, place your palms down and press up. Excellent job. Now you're gonna bring your knees forward just like this. Great job. And for your next one, if you can sit like this, that's okay. If you can't, go ahead and lay down onto your hips. You can go ahead and bring this arm right over here. Go ahead and lift the shoulder for some extra stretch. And now we're gonna go ahead and stretch the other side.
great job. Excellent. You all did so amazing for this workout. I'm so proud of you. You're getting stronger and stronger every day. Just keep up the hard work and you will be hitting those goals right before you know it. All right, bye.